Hey, hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sakar Prachapati and in this video, I'm going to talk about one of the most important SQL interview questions. So I will be solving through my uh, code and I will let you know what is uh, what what is the concept behind uh, this question. So uh, if you are fresh or if you are someone who is having two, three years of experience in the SQL, uh, SQL domain, then please watch this video till the end so that you will get a better understanding of this question. So chala, let's get started. So before the video, I would like to introduce my channel Geek Coders. Here I upload videos on SQL, Python and uh, Databricks and Edit Data Factory and so on. So if you are liking my content, please subscribe to my channel so that everyone will get benefited. So, so let's get started so i will be opening my uh google chrome and here you can see i have opened one website called datalima.com and here you can see there is a filter there is a, a multiple questions present over here right so i will be solving a question which was asked in jp morgan so if i write here jp then you can see we have two questions one is easy and second one is medium so i will be solving this card issues difference question okay so let me open this now you can see uh, here uh, this is the you know this is a question your team at jp morgan chase is soon launching a new credit card and to gain some context you are analyzing how many credit cards were issued each month okay now if you can see over here that uh, they have written a writer query that outputs the name of the each credit card and the difference in issued amount between the months with the most card issued and the least card issued okay and order the result according to the biggest difference and this is the scheme of the table you can see and this is the sample input so and this is the sample output so for 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 understanding purpose i have uh, created a dummy data set over here okay in the excel and then we will let you know you know what we need to do and what they are asking so basically they are asking they are asking which card i mean uh, the difference the difference the the difference in uh, each each issued month issued amount in each card so for an example if i take this uh, choose chase freedom flex then you can see this is the issued amount five five 55,000 which is the very minimum and uh, in the month of uh, 4th okay in the month of 4th the issued amount is 70,000 so this is the minimum amount of this uh, card name and this is the maximum amount so we need to find the difference between these two likewise for the card name the maximum amount is uh, this 18 one lakh eighty thousand and the minimum amount is one lakh seventy thousand so we need to we need to what we need to uh, write down the difference between these min and max amount simple so let's go back to here and if i run this then you can see we have some kind of uh, output over here okay what i will do i will write here card name card underscore name because we need a card name right in our uh, uh, output i use min i use min over here so why i'm using min because i need to find out the minimum amount of each card so i i am writing here issued issued underscore amount okay let's say as min amount and here i am writing max issued as max underscore amount okay now what i'm doing here i am writing group by and group by on what basis on card because i need to find out on basis of cards right so that's why i have written over card card name over here so if i do run code then you can see we have this chase freedom flex that is fifty five thousand minimum and then we have this chase uh, chase sapphire reserve the minimum amount is this and the maximum amount is this what we discussed okay now 
what they ask they ask the query the result in the decreasing in the decreasing order the order the result according to the biggest difference so here what i will do i will write here order by order by and uh, okay with this what i need to do is that i need to make a difference right so i will use here max minus min and give the name difference okay and remove this line because we do not need it and order by difference as decreasing order so i have to specify here this keyword so if i run this uh, there is an error right uh, syntax error at all okay what is the issue okay i have used this comma that is not needed over here so if i click on run code then you can see we have this data we have this output right so if i submit it let's see whether it will work or not see it works right so this is the simple question which was asked in jp morgan company which is a product based company and i hope you have understood this concept and if you do like it please share with your friends so that everyone will get benefit